I find that consumers do way more lying during a transaction than car salespeople do. And yes, this will be on YouTube, and I'm talking to you consumers out there. Um, I may have to cut that part out. <laughs> a friend of mine the other day was shopping for a Lexus. He goes, hey, how do I get a good deal on a Lexus? I said, show up. He said, what do you mean? I said, just you know, do your research. Show up. Okay, offer to pay them a small profit. And if it's a vehicle that's in high demand, they won't take the deal. If it's a vehicle that's not in high demand, they'll probably give you a big hug if you offer to pay them a small profit. I said, find a salesman that you like and don't lie to him. He looked at me and said, what do you mean don't lie to a salesman? He goes, I'm worried about the salesman lying to me. I said, Look, trust me, consumers do way more lying during the automotive purchase process than salespeople do. We're under suspicion from the moment we, we, from the moment we meet and greet them, right? There we can, <clears throat> there's no such thing as one of us making an honest mistake, because if we make a mistake, what's it considered to be? A, lie. a dishonest mistake, a lie. So most of the salespeople I know, and I'm, not, and I'm not kidding, are way more honest during the transaction than the consumers. The consumer will say anything. It's another thing they're taught in third grade. Be a good citizen. Don't lie, cheat, or steal. Unless you're on a car dealership lot, then anything goes. Okay? 